So placement of supplies is part of 5S. And it's, a, it's probably one of the most important pieces of 5S. In addition to seeing the tools that you need to perform an assay, you want to make sure that you have the supplies that you're going to need for all day work. So again, you're not interrupted. If those supplies are hidden in a drawer or in a cabinet, you can't see them. So the lab of the future, which we haven't built yet, will have no cabinets and will have no drawers. We in fact don't have cabinet doors in a lot of our laboratory. We took them all off and uh, knowing what they cost us, originally it was very sad to see them go. I wish they'd gone to my kitchen actually, but my wife wouldn't, she, she didn't buy into that. But they would have been very nice cabinet doors for a kitchen. So um, hidden supplies is really the, the root cause of expired supplies. So if they're hidden or they're underneath, they're not visible, then you can bet your next inspector is going to find that expired supply hiding underneath uh, everything that you're using today because it got pushed to the back. And we, in fact, if we're on an inspection, we know where to look. We look in the drawers that are the deepest, and you'll find the hidden expired supplies. Every time we do a 5S event, either in the laboratory or the hospital, we find, and I hate to tell you, it's, it can be in the thousands of dollars of expired reagents because they're hidden away. Throughout the hospital, and we've adopted in the laboratory as well, we have a two-bin supply inventory system uh, that's calculated exactly to how much of the supply we need. When the front bin is empty, it's put up on top of the rack for refilling, and the bin behind it is pulled forward. And that has fresh supplies, and that bin, we know we'll have enough of that uh, item to last until we get replenishment of the first bin, which then goes behind the one we're now using. So it's a double bin, we call it the blue bin system. It has saved the hospital millions of dollars. It saves the laboratory. No one has to go looking for supplies because we know that they're going to be there.